You unlock this door with the key of imagination. Beyond it is another realm with an amplitude of sound, a spectrum of sight and the immense scope of the mind. You're navigating into a realm of things and ideas. You've just teleported over into the third millennium. Hello, my name is the Third Millennium Knight and welcome to my channel. If you like gaming, comic book, and film content, please sub and like and ring that bell for more. Today we'll be talking about uh, the ultimately rejected Batman Beyond animated film. Since the concept art has dropped a few days ago, uh, Twitter has been in a frenzy. The project is reportedly pitched by Patrick Harpin, a storyboard artist who is also a co-creator of the Netflix show My Dad the Bounty Hunter, featuring the voices as Alonzo and Freya Ferguson. Being a storyboard artist, this concept art looks amazing dynamic and incredibly cinematic honestly i personally love the use of color in the cityscape background how any batman beyond film whether live action or animated hasn't been made yet is honestly beyond me pun not intended this has gotten many a comic book nerd excited on twitter and undoubtedly will lead to putting more pressure on Warner Brothers and hopefully James Gunn to get new projects out. As they've recently gotten a lot of flack from uh, Stephen Amell, the previous Green Arrow from the CW show, for announcing projects and not exactly following through and getting them produced. This is a double-edged sword, however, because uh, Hasty Productions, in my opinion, honestly killed the Snyderverse and the larger DCEU. And we really do not need uh, any more Sny or, uh, any more uh, Sony type productions, uh, which are poorly written shows like Madam Web and uh, M like Madam Web and Morbius. It's not Morbin time. Ultimate comparison to this is probably the Spider Verse shows uh, that have been recently produced by Sony, however, which are fantastic. And uh, hopefully a project like this does get made at some point, whether it's live action or animated. I personally would love to see a live action version of Batman Beyond, but not everything needs a live action remake. I think Netflix is learning that uh, every day. The Avatar trailer looks absolutely horrendous. But uh, One Piece was surprisingly good, and so I'm leaving out a lot of hope for that. But if you want to see this project made, or if you have any comments or thoughts on the project, let me know and leave a comment down below. And what are your thoughts on the uh, larger new DCEU? And if you have any other questions, uh, leave a comment below and please like and subscribe and ring that bell, of course.